make another video for my series of camp leaders videos. Yeah, it's gonna be a really, really quick one. Um, so basically, obviously, to go to America, you need to get your visa, and to get your visa, you need to go to the US Embassy. And they call it an embassy, like, interview. And I know, especially when I went for the first time, I was, like, stressing. I was like, oh, what are they gonna ask me? Like, it's an interview, like, will they reject me? And it can be, like, really, really stressful in your first year. But I've done it, like, five times now. And honestly, I just wanna put some people at ease because it really isn't what you think it is. It is an interview, but it's an interview in the sense that they ask you questions, but the questions aren't like hard questions. Basically, the two main questions they'll ask you is where you're going in America and what you're going to be doing there. Um, and then they'll also ask you, like, what do you do now? So are you working? Are you a student? Um, and they probably ask you what you'll do when you get back. But yeah, I'm not really going to talk about the preparations for that because camp meetings really go into like really like a lot of detail about how to like fill out your application, how to book your appointment, and all that kind of stuff. I was going to tell you what actually happens on the day. So basically what happens on the day is you get all your paperwork from camp leaders um, they'll wait outside the embassy for you you send your name, they give you the paperwork you need and then you kind of like line up there'll be people from like other camp agencies there so there'll be like Camp America there, like Boonac probably be there um, USA Summer Camp probably be there and then you kind of wait in line it varies, I mean every time I've went the queue was like, I don't know, 15, 20 minutes it's not long at all they kind of like check your paperwork, they check that you have your the instructions and the, I can't remember what the form is called basically the form that have your picture on it that you print off after you um, apply for your visa, you just bring that with you, they tell you things, bring that with you, you bring it with you, and they'll check that. They make sure you have all your like paperwork and all that, they'll check your passport and all that kind of thing. When you make it past that, you go for security, and they just tell you, like, they have guns, okay? Like, they, they have guns, so don't look those people in the eye. You then you actually make it into the embassy. You'll get a number, and then you just wait, kind of like when at Argos, and you just kind of just wait. There'll be like a massive screen at the front, and then they'll call the numbers up. Um, so there are two windows you go to. The first window, really straightforward, they'll kind of check your paperwork, they'll, probably t they'll take your fingerprints as well. Um, and then you go through to the next window, and then that's kind of where they'll ask you the questions, what you're going to have to do, um, where you stay in, um, what do you do now. It's all a formality really, like the questions are just a formality. As long as you're not some sort of like murderer, or some sort of like criminal, then your visa probably won't get rejected, honestly. And obviously, camp leaders will make sure that you're in the best possible state to like get accepted. So I really, really worry, wouldn't worry about it too much. And also, a lot of people have been asking about what do you wear to the MC interview. Honestly, like I said, it's not an interview. Interview is like a job interview. You don't have to go wearing a suit or really smart clothes. Just go what you feel comfortable in, honestly. Like they're not gonna be like, oh no, you're wearing, you're wearing, a, uh, you're wearing shorts. We can't let you in. You're not getting your visa. No, it doesn't work like that. And that's pretty much it. Like there's three, there's literally nothing to be scared about, nothing to be nervous about. The people that are also really nice. Um, they don't want to reject your visa, so they just need to go like through the security checks um, to make sure that they can allow you into the country. And yeah, that's pretty much it, really. Just like smile, be happy, um, just answer their questions, and honestly, you'll be fine. The visa normally takes around like two weeks, maybe. Be, I think, I think maybe every time I've done it, it's been less than two weeks. But yeah, it doesn't take too long to come. And then once you get it, then you're pretty much set to go to America. I just wanted to make this quick video because I've seen a lot of questions and people worrying about it, but I just kind of want to put you at ease. It's, it's not that bad. But yeah, as always, if you have any questions relating to camp, then get in touch, let me know. I'm available on like Facebook, Instagram, Twitter sometimes, whatever. But just message me and I'll be happy to answer any questions you have. Um, if you've been placed at camp, then I hope you look forward to it. It's the best time ever. And I hope you have a really, really, really good summer. And as always, if you like, like, if you want to subscribe, subscribe, and peace.